the Golden Jubilee service attracted numerous dignitaries, including members of the Federal Executive Council, national directors of ministries and agencies, members of the National Assembly, ministers of God, among others. Vice President Osibanjo described Senator Bintamasi Garba as a visionary and exemplary leader who dedicated her time and activities in promoting the cause of humanity. He commended the contributions of Christians in government for impacting positively in governance. The Vice President solicited for special prayers for leaders and the country to overcome challenges. To rely on public and prayers, that what you want to see done in this nation, pray that those of us who God has put there will be able to get that thing done. What you want to see for the future of this nation, pray. We pray, we fast, we talk to each other. We know what our house Wife of the President, Aisha Buhari, represented by the Director General of Women Development, Mary Eta, described the celebrant as a sister and a mentor that struggled to ensure that women in Nigeria are respected and given their rightful position. Secretary to the Government of the Federation, Barista Boss Gida Mustafa, said the attainment of 50 years of the lawmaker is a great joy to Nigerians because of her commitment in the nation building. Deputy Governor Martins Babale described Senator Marcy Garba as a woman of quality who dedicated her resources and abilities to emancipate the downtrodden. In a message titled, What is Your Life? Bishop Fred Ado described the event as worthy considering her service to humanity. He admonished well-to-do individuals in the society to extend hand of love and fellowship to people by impacting positively in their lives. The celebrant, Binta Masi Garba, attributed her success in life to the love and mercy of God.